Hi guys, today I'll show you how to solve equations using your calculator. This is very fundamental for how we work in math and it's important you know how to. Uh, when you use your calculator it's often uh, faster than doing it by hand, but the downside is that it might be give you a number that is rounded off slightly, as I'll show you in a second. Um, so we have an equation, say this one, 5x minus 8 equals negative 14, and you want to solve that. You can do it by hand. We have the same equation. How you solve the equation is what you do on one side, you do on the other. In this case, they added 8 on both sides to give you 5x equals negative 6. In order to get rid of the 5, you divide by 5 on both sides, you get x equals negative 1.2. Using your calculator, you press math and you go down until you find the solver. There it is. We will probably go one up instead. Yeah, <laughs> probably faster. And here you have the equation solver. So it does help you, but it n needs the equation in a certain way. It needs to have equals one and then the equation. And this is not what we have. So I have to move, the easiest thing is to move the 14 to that side. So I have 5, the x is on this button, 5x. I have negative 8 plus 14, that is 6, like that. I press enter. Then you go in here and it will ask for a guess. What do you think it is? I don't know. I'll just leave it as this is a number that was there before. I don't know what it is. Bound is where we'll search for a solution. You don't have to worry about that. Uh, the solve button is down here. It's highlighted or it's in green, so I have to press alpha and then enter. And now it's solved. It actually gave me the same number as before. Huh. I've probably done this before. So the answer is negative 1.2. Uh, here it says that the left hand side, if I take the left hand side and subtract the right hand side, I get zero using this number. So this is a solution. And it's actually the same solution as you found using or done by hand. I can see if I use a older version of the calculator, you get a answer that is negative one point one nine 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 and it's th that's what I talked about. That is number is not well, correct, but if you round off three significant figures, you get the same answer. You can see here that I put in 5x plus 6 equals 0. They just put t took this side of the equation, 5x minus 8, go away, and then s added 14 on both sides. They didn't even bother to calculate that negative 8 plus 14 is 6. So that's, that's how it works. You can also get an equation like this. Now, what you need to know is that the calculator only works with x's and not y's. So you have to substitute all the y's by x. But then you do the same thing. You move one up. And you say, OK, oh, yeah. what you do is you put this in. I have 1 half y plus 12 and then subtract this side. Remember to substitute the y's with x. So you get this side, subtract 2x plus 3 equals 0, and again you can solve it and you get x equals 10. You can have uh, equations that are, what would you say, harder to solve, but it all works in the same way, just move things to either side, it doesn't matter which side, so you have something equal to zero and then you solve. Remember if you have something with an equation that there's something that is hidden for us, well it's not hidden because we were lazy when we wrote this, there's parentheses here in the numerator, so when you 
uh, put it in your calculator. Remember the parentheses here. It is all of this three oh, three minus two x. All of this has to be divided by four. So you need parentheses here, and then subtract five x in order to get it over here. So you have equals zero, and you use give it a guess. Doesn't matter which get it guess it is, and uh, alpha and solve. And that's that. I'll just take this one for the last. See what it get. Um, three minus two x. All of that divided by four minus five. Enter. I guess I don't know. I'll just take this. Solve. Left hand side subtract right hand side equals zero so this is good solution I can see oh. don't do that so uh, y equals negative 8.5 and again my calculator is better than this version which would say negative 8.4999999 I think if you have a newer calculator with the color display you can just put the equations of the equation in as it is and solve but I'm not sure you have to check for yourself or consult the manual I'll put some exercises online for you great have fun